Okay, this is another grocery haul video um, for my family of 10. This is not a weekly grocery haul. Um, I ran into Walmart this morning after church um, just to pick up some things that we were out of. Um, my last two week grocery haul actually carried over. It's gonna carry over into this week. So that's really good. Um, so I just picked up some things to finish out the week. Plus I had bulk on my mind. Also, I needed to throw some stuff in our deep freezer. Um, just to, I like to keep that stocked up for um, obviously times when we need it um, and stuff like that. So I basically just ran in and um, I really don't like doing that, but there are, I did have a list and there are some things that I needed okay, to so do. Okay, so now I'm going to go through and show you um, some of the things that we got today. Okay, so I'm always getting a case of water. We go through uh, one of these uh, every week. Um, and since I carried over into this week, um, I needed to pick this up to last for the, uh, for the rest of this week. Grab some Gatorade. Picked up um, just four bags of chips. Um, they were on sale, uh, two for five dollars on some of these. Okay, I got only three boxes of cereal, Frosted Flakes, Honeycomb, and Rice Chex. We usually get through a box of breakfast, if that made any sense. Um, I got two of the big Folgers. Um, we're not big coffee drinkers around here, but I have it every morning, like with my Bible study and stuff like that, and then I'm done. I won't usually drink hardly any more after that. Um, and then like my daughters and some of the teenagers, they'll, they'll drink some with me every, every now and then every morning. And, uh, my husband will every now and then we're not big coffee drinkers. So these should last us a long time. I got two, okay, two of I those. picked up a big Hawaiian punch. Usually I don't grab these, but, um, sometimes I do some, they're just fun. And uh, that one's really good. I picked up two more juices for this week. I have a white grape and an apple. Um, I was running low on soy sauce, so I had to get another container of it. This is the one gallon um, soy sauce. Usually what I do, if you haven't seen any of my other videos, is I just pour these into these little glass soy sauce containers. I picked up a big two quart jar of pickles. Um, I have just a couple of big boxes of the snacks, the star crunches, and the fed rounds, because those are fun. Um, I picked up um, the big 24 pack of granola bars with three different flavors. Um, I am making um, a chicken dish and I needed some chicken broth and I actually was short a little bit, so I picked up two more. I've got a big 36 pack of the corn dogs. I picked up the big mega pack, the, it has 50 of them of the fruit smileys. I've got four gallons of milk. And actually what I will do with those is I will probably just put these in the deep freezer. I try to keep that stocked up with milk. And we have four already in the fridge. And then when I start back on my regular um, one or two week grocery hauls and my menus for those week, then I'll just pretend these aren't even in the freezer until it's time to use them. And uh, yeah, so just um, that's what I'm going to do with those. Just stick those in there. I got two big containers of the tea bags, the gallon size. I picked up these cans again. These are the big uh, six pound cans. Um, the peaches are the 6.5, I think. And then the corn is the 6, 6.5. And then the green beans are the 6 also. Um, those are always great to have now that my Walmart has started to carry those. So far this is all that we have in bulk as far as the big cans and the, the great value brand. So I'm really, really hoping that they maybe kind of get some more. And only because I don't have a Sam's Club or a Costco or anything like that. So I have to just deal with the Walmart that I have here. So um, I'm, I love it when they carry those. Um, just a couple of pack of hot dogs. I'm going to throw those in the freezer. A couple of packs of bacon. And that's actually all they had or I would have got more. Um, I'm just going to throw those in the freezer. I usually grab a thing of string cheese that we eat on the way home. But we just didn't this time because I don't know why. But most of the time we're into it before we get home. Okay, I picked up the big 10 pound bag of the boneless skinless chicken breast. Um, I usually will get 
uh, however many they have, but they rarely ever have these. And um, so when I do see them, I snag them and throw them in the deep freezer. So that's great. I'm really excited about that. Um, I got my big jar of Nutella, which is almost a staple around here. Um, big thing of peanut butter. This is the, yeah, the four pound. I was going to say it, but I'm like, no, better better look. I got an apple butter. Um, that's kind of a favorite. I'd really actually like to start making that um, and replacing that purchase. Um, I've got a mozzarella block and a cheddar block only because we eat so much of that throughout the week and it's really just good to snack on too. I picked up five of the tortillas. Those are great for breakfast wraps or lunches. You could do Nutella, peanut butter, ham and cheese, whatever. They're just, they're cheap and they are a favorite. I've also just picked up some rice sides for our meals. These are also great for um, just adding chicken into them. Um, you could grab a couple more and actually have a main dish or just use them for sides. I also picked up a big thing of goldfish. We were running low on that. Um, this right here, I, if you've noticed any of my other videos, I usually get like the extra butter this or extra butter that or whatever, um, cause it's fabulous. But I tried this one time. I don't know if you guys have tried this. It is so good. Unfortunately, I can't get it in a bigger size and it only comes with six bags. So I picked up four of them, <laughs> but, um, we do this for movie night every night or every movie night. And they, this is so good for somebody who likes extra butter popcorn. I think you should try this. It's really good. I, it says natural, simply salted, but trust me, give it a try. It is really, really good. Okay. Um, we were running low on mayonnaise. So this is the big um, one quart thing of mayonnaise. This should last us a little bit. I just picked up some canned goods. We've got all four cans here are mandarin oranges. If I could get them in the larger cans, I would because my kids really like them. Um, I grabbed some pineapple in the large can, some fruit cocktail, stuff like that. Some pears, you know, those are great for lunches, stuff like that. I uh, got some yogurt here. The... The big two pound containers of yogurt, and I'll use these for smoothies. Um, big two things of applesauce. Okay, so I've got some dressing, some Catalina, some ranch, some ranch with bacon. Those are pretty much our favorites around here. Um, we were running a little bit low, and I needed to grab some more for the rest of this week, and I can carry it on to next week. Um, anytime Walmart carries these, I always try to grab these. These are great snacks, and they're, they're healthy, and they're so yummy. Um, all this bread here, I'm just going to throw in the freezer. So, yeah, I'm just going to throw all of these in the deep freezer. I've got two, four wheat breads, four hot dog buns. Um, this was some clearance bread, the bagels, and the, um, the French loaf. I always grab those and throw those in the deep freezer. We have a bunch of those, and they are so great for when you're you're needing a bread for a meal and you just need to, you didn't have time to make it or whatever, and you can just pull it out of the freezer and it's ready to go. Um, so I think I pretty much covered everything. Um, this will get us through the rest of the week and then some, of course. Most of this I'm just going to put up um, or put in my deep freezer. And so now I guess I'm going to put everything up and thanks for watching.